Hi everyone, welcome to Billy Six Drill Golf. And tonight I want to share with you one of probably one of the biggest drills that has affected me in my teaching, and it's one that Mike Malaska has uh, worked with me on uh, for quite a few years, and that's the level drill. And it's um, to me, I think it's it's one of the purest feelings that you can feel in a golf swing. Um, I know I always refer back to this. Uh, I work with this drill a lot because it gives us such a, a sensation or a good sensation and it really simplifies what the golf swing, uh, you know, in my opinion, should feel like. And it's kind of in, in, its, in its simplest form, trying to make golf easier. So when you look at what the, the swing is doing, we've got this golf club. So in the simplest terms that I can explain what the golf swing is doing, you get your hands on the, on the club right and you start working the face first, right? We've got to get control over the face. Next, you start getting control over the path, right? That's one of the biggest things is try to feel how the face of the club and how it works in relation to the path. Once you can feel that, right? Obviously, that's done with a lot with my hands, wrists, and arms because that's what touches the club. Once you can feel that, your body starts to work and involve itself with trying to supply support to that path and how the club stays on the path or the swing path. So my body is supporting what the club is doing. Now, what it feels like is that the golf club is more out in front of me, I think, than, than most people realize. Because when I, when I put this level drill in front of them, it's, it's, it's almost like something they've never felt before. And, and I, can, I can say that it was, for me, that was the same experience. So what is the level drill? So what I'd have you do is swing back, swing up to the top. Now as I swing down and my hand gets closer to my right thigh, as the club is starting to come down, I'm gonna leave the face of the club up above my hands. And now I'm gonna swing the face around in front of me. The handle stays in front of me. The golf club is still above my hands and it works around to the left. So there's a number of things that just happened there Those are that are, are extremely good feelings to have and to incorporate into your swing when you actually hit a ball. The first one was how the face of the club is swinging around and in front of me. So at no point did I feel like the club was trapped behind me. At no point did I feel like the center of my chest was way out in front of the club. At no point did I feel this club was way to the inside and coming to the outside. I felt the club swing around me. I felt the club swing in front of me. And I also felt how this club in the center or my sternum of my body are starting to move at appropriate or compatible speeds. See, I know this golf club's got a lot farther and a lot faster to travel much more than this center. This is, this is much like my outer circle. I, the, the swing is made up of three major circles. The face of the club, the grip and my hands and arms are on one, and my body or my center is one. So that gives me a very distinct feeling of what this golf swing in a, in a, in a very simple form should feel like. Now I know there's more than, than one ways to swing a club, but I feel like this is, this is one of the simplest ways to learn golf. So as I get back, see my body rotates and gets out of the way. And as my club comes down in front of me, the handle comes down and the face comes around and in front of me. So if I made a swing, if I start up here and, and the, the club head is above my hands the whole time, I'll go very slow. I can feel how the club works around me. It works in front of me. Now, those are very good practice swings to make. The only difference that's going to happen when I make a regular swing is the weight of the club when it gets down in front of me here as I swing back down the weight of the club is going to unhinge and go into the ball and rehinge over here. But everything else is going to feel the same. So I can start to feel even with this level drill I can start to feel as I swing down and the club face works out See, my body all already automatically starts to push away from the club. So it gives me a sense of how much room I need for this club to get back down in front of me. And it gives me a sense of how much room 
I mean, because this whole golf club's got to come in front of me. But my body starts to react without me even thinking about it. So all of a sudden, we've got this object flying around in front of us, and our body starts to react how it would if I just had any type of object, like the hammer throw going around me. As the, as the, as the hammer would go out here, my body would push back. We're offsetting these different components. So we're offsetting these different forces. So I'm gonna make one level drill swing, and then I'm gonna make one practice swing, and then I'm gonna hit my ball. And this is how I would encourage you to do. So again, we're gonna make one level drill. So the face is up here, it goes back, and comes around. That was, see, when I added speed there, the face of the club went down a little bit. So if I go a little slower, I'm able to control that face of the club a little bit more. Now as I go a little, little faster, See the club, all of a sudden the club automatically reacted and it went down a little bit. Now I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna get it up here. I'm gonna feel like it's a level drill, but I'm gonna let the weight of the club just go down into the ball now. So all I did was allow the weight of the club to come down and go right into the golf ball and it felt very similar to what I was doing with that level drill. We'll do it one more time. Level drill. So you start out very slow. So it's above my hands. Now as I add a little bit of speed, the club starts to go down. Okay, now I'm gonna, go, now I'm gonna relax and do the same thing, let the club face run into the ball. So you can see how similar that feels. It, would, it feels nothing. Like if I were to swing this club, it feels nothing like if I were to swing this club and get way out in front of this club, it would feel nothing like that because the club is too far behind me. So if you wanna play your best golf and simplify this game, simplify this golf swing, try this level drill, it, it's unbelievable the, the amount of things that you can learn from just applying what these forces are naturally going to do when you put the club up, get it going around you, get it in front of you a little bit, and it, and I can't tell you how, how good it feels to feel how that club is because it, you're, you feel like you're in so much more control when the face gets around you. You have, you don't feel like you're trying to catch the face up so much. So give this level drill a try, and I hope it helps your games as much as it's helped mine and my students. Hi everyone, like and subscribe to my channel, Billy Fitzgerald Golf, for all tips on golf. If you'd like a live lesson or want to send me a message, visit me at billyfitzgeraldgolf.com.